this is part three of my dangerous descent into the mine shaft with Daniel Durand being my forward man and Hector as my rope prep guy as well as my support crew up top. Going deeper into the mine, dodging falling rocks and then going further down yet. Enjoy part three. Please give it a like and subscribe. We risked our lives on this one. Yeah, I don't know why that's going off now. Oh, it's huge down here. Yeah, it's only, it's only. Alright, um, we probably shouldn't go down too much farther because that's going off. Alright, we made it down to another level. It's dusty, but it's hard to see if there's a bottom there because it just goes and goes into the dust. But the vein is super wide right here. Well, top, middle, and third. Alright, turn my flashlight on. Whoa, it's really, holy smokes, it's huge. Um, I don't see my camera anywhere. I'll go down here and look, but oh my goodness, it's huge. All right, going down. Dude, I'm running out of rope. Daniel, I'm gonna get off the rope, but only if you're gonna come down. I'm gonna leave my descender on so I know which rope to pull on. All right, I'm down. Whoa. So that's plugged. A lot of pigeon wings down here. I can't believe how big this is. I'm out of the way. Oh, hang on. So actually in here you can't. Um, make sure that the little white rope is clipped on something so it doesn't get pulled up. Beer bottle. I wonder if there's a date on it. 1925. So this is where stuff could still fall. So my camera should be around here somewhere. I'm gonna turn this down a little bit. So you can better the life of it. So far no camera. them out of the way of falling rocks. I didn't think it'd be this big down here. How you feeling? Good. All right. I haven't seen my camera anywhere. My camera. Yeah. Ha! We found it. Holy smokes! It's <laughs> it's all busted up. Let's see if the card's any. It appears the card is still good. How deep do you think we are? Lenses aren't even stretched up that bad. Let's see if it turns on. Battery's probably dead. Yeah. Uh, Hector's got more batteries in 
his um, thing. How do I keep this? Last time I put one in my wallet, it got broke. Um, See if it snaps in. Yep, yeah. it snapped. <laughs> Just take so we're good, <laughs> as long as we have this. It was so big down there, I'm gonna show you a couple minutes of our walk before we headed back up. And look at all the gold stuff. It's a gold mine and we're super deep. This has gotta be gold, don't you say? Yeah, probably. I mean, should we bring up a little bit or should we more worry about getting our lives back up top? <laughs> so how deep we are. All right, I'll bring this up from the bottom. That one pass, I'm so worried about that going back up. Are you? Uh, not really. <laughs> not really? Yeah. We'll, we'll get to that point where we get there. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, I'm gonna bring this rock here. Gold, yes, or gold, no? It's a gold mine. This is the gold from the Mayans, so there was tons of it. It appears to be like fool's gold, but if we melt it down, will it be real? That's the big question. The GoPros didn't pick up the true color in the rocks, but Daniel took this short video with his phone, which shows what it actually looked like in real life. I can't believe how big it is down yep. here. Amazing. And then let's not lose our spot on the wall where we go up. All right, I'm bringing that one little rock back up. We got what we came down here for. Now all we gotta do is get our lives back to the top. They said the gold's in the black rock. This is a black rock. Does it dent? Let's see if this scratches. That's pretty cool. I think it left a mark. But you would need a lot of this to amount to anything. But there's a lot of it down here. Way down here. That is an awesome chunk right there. Oh man. A big house? Deep basement. We're doomed. Not doomed, we'd just be down here for a few days. All right, right there is where we came to the end of our rope. For the last bit, we had to double it, and we put that to the rock. In case they pull on the rope to see if we're still on it, we don't want it to go up out of reach. This is the biggest room in a mine I've ever seen, and we're super, super deep. And there's all kinds of orange, yellow, shiny stuff in the black rock, like they said, like this rock here. Uh, but I don't know if it's gold or fool's gold. And then there's quartz, and we are exploring. Hmm. Hope we don't get lost. All right. Is that a bat? There. Well, we did it. We're not at the very bottom. If we had more rope, we could go further but we're probably not gonna do that, right? Not sure yet. <laughs> You're not sure yet. <laughs> so there's more to be explored for someone else some other day. Shall we go back up? Yeah. Look at that, the size of that rock. <laughs> All these giant rocks, I think they fell from the ceiling. All the minerals, like different colors and stuff, are so cool to see. Yeah. See what's on the other side. Ah. Oh, it just keeps going. Okay, climb back up. The top is it now? 4.04. 4.04? Si. Started coming down here at 12? 
So four hours to get down, the rest of the day to get back up. On our way up, we're only three levels from the top now, and this is the part none of us were looking forward to. So, it's showing that we're recording. We are on our way back up. This is the camera that fell. The bottom is all busted. But uh, this is the most dangerous part of the whole climb. Wouldn't you say? Yep. Yeah. If we were past this, uh, yeah. I think we made it. It was at this point we realized how serious of a situation we're in. Come this way, to the left. Esquerra, esquerra, esquerra. What do you think? Tell him softly, softly, really softly. This is the part I didn't want to go through. The higher he goes, the safer he is, right? Oh, is he at the, the worst part? No, uh, he's almost getting at the worst part. Okay. Yeah, I think it's, it's like another 